Hi, this is Kim Berbitsky with the Dermatology Center of Indiana. I'm going to talk to you today about the pityriasis rosea stages. Pityriasis rosea is a disease that older children and healthy young adults get. It's uh, characterized by a rash that's on your trunk, upper arms, and upper legs. It's usually people don't have any symptoms with it. If they do, it's just usually mild itching. No one really understands why people get pityriasis rosea, but it's characterized by three stages. Uh, the first is a prodrome where but only under 50% of people will get this, but you get like a little fever, just a general sense of not feeling well, headaches, sore throat, and that lasts about a week. And then the second stage is where the rash begins, and about 50 to 90% of people will get the second stage. And it's where you get a single, larger, red scaling oval lesion, somewhere usually on your trunk, and it grows slightly gradually over a few days. It's usually between two and 10 centimeters, and that's called the herald patch. The third stage happens about two weeks after the herald patch. You'll get little, smaller, oval, slightly scaly bumps all over your trunk, your upper arms, your upper legs, neck, usually not on the face. And those lesions stay small, but they get a little scale around the outside of them. Typically, on the back, it looks like, looks like a Christmas tree. You'll have these little scaling patches and you know, diagonally downward slanted lines that kind of resembles a fir tree and a V-shape in the front. That rash lasts for two to three months and uh, then it goes away on its own, even without treatment, and it is not contagious. Thank you very much.